Hello everyone, what is your Divine Masculine feeling today, the 9th of November 2023? Well, your Divine Masculine is feeling strong, he's feeling wiser, he's also reflecting on many things that have been happening in the past, in the present, and he's also awaiting the future. In other words, he has been misguided a lot by the external world in terms of brainwashing and mind washing and the influence of not so good peers and, and, and the whole love culture of the 21st century has created a major scar in him. And he wants you to know that he's awakening from that. He knows that what he has with you is spiritual and beyond infinite evolution, truth, reality. He wants you to also know that he has taken back his power and is feeling stronger than ever. So he, the messages he has for you today is to stay strong and not give your power away to anyone because this journey is a vulnerable journey and both of you are vulnerable. He acknowledges that he is vulnerable and so are you. Hence, he does not want you to give your power away and God is all that exists. If you want, if you feel down, you can always talk to him. That's what he wants you to know. He's opening up his channel he's opening up himself for more 5d communication so he wants you in fact he urges you to communicate more with him in the fifth dimension just talk to him like you would do in 3d but of course you want to do it internally and he will receive the messages he wants you to know that also, he has learned recently that he has been giving away his power a lot to the external world. Bad friendships, people who did not have the best interest in their mind for him. So he wants to apologize for you if he had hurt you directly or indirectly. Yes, it was true. Back in 2021, back in 2022, he did listen to his friends and it did create a wider gap because he just couldn't get his head around what this journey was about. And, and these friends, either they were NPCs or they were friends who were quite ignorant and they just told him to move on. Hence, he wants to apologize for that because he should have listened to himself. He should have listened to the universe. He should have listened to God. But instead, he took the bad advice from people who are not really people who are not really interested in his well-being or growth or evolution so he apologizes for he apologizes for that he also wants you to know that he is now much stronger much more independent in thought and he's much wiser as well because he's having a major crown chakra awakening hence why he's able to make connections and find that alignment in that universe and between you and him and is so excited about what the future is going to hold and he wants you to stay so strong because right now it's a testing period and he wants you to not give up on him and the journey and he wants you to know that he is so in love with you and that his heart keeps crying out your name and he knows that you're one and he knows that you're both expressing your soul in two different bodies and he understand that in fact recently he even had a vision of how you split in the 13th dimension as a divine feminine and divine masculine so he's so he's so marveled by what he saw and he's also been doing a lot of astral traveling and you have been meeting a lot in the astral world and now he wants you to anchor that to 3d in other words he's saying that the meeting in 3d is going to happen soon because you've been talking and meeting a lot in the astral worlds in the etheric and in the 5d and he's been having such a wonderful time and he thanks you he misses the 3d he misses your cooking he misses your talking he misses your he misses is everything about you and he wants you to know that he loves you and this is what i have for you guys today i hope you have enjoyed today's channeling and if you have done so please do like share and subscribe and i will come back again with another channeling till then take care love you all and see you all tomorrow